Shalom, brothers and sisters. Shalom. So I uh, want to come here today, talk a little bit about this. Uh, uh, a man having multiple wives. That's right. A man having multiple wives. We can turn back to the biblical days. The Bible is called concubines. A man had multiple wives. Many, 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 many men in the Bible had multiple wives. So is a man only supposed to have one wife? No. Not according to the Bible. A man is designed and set up to have multiple wives. He's created that way. The creator of the universe created men to have multiple wives. Still in some parts around the world, I work with a guy from the country of Jordan. Now, each country is a little different. But in Jordan, the country of Jordan, a man is allowed to have four wives. He's allowed to have four wives. Now, it's different in every country. Each country is a little different with their laws, the government's laws and stuff on, on marriage. But in the Bible, the men of the Bible, they had many wives, many children. You remember, uh, you might recall, uh, Noah's Ark, the flood came in and wiped out everything, right? Everybody died except the people who were on Noah's Ark. So for them to, uh, recreate for them to uh they had to breed to recreate and establish people in the world the flood wiped everybody out everybody drowned except the people who built the ark and noah and the people on the ark they had to recreate a civilization of people how did they do that? They had multiple wives. The men had multiple wives. They had many children. Many, many, many children. They had. The Bible clearly states and shows that a man is created, designed, and set up to have multiple wives, not a mono, monolygamous with one wife. That's not what the man is designed to do. The woman is created to have one husband, according to the Bible. But now the man is designed and set up to have multiple wives. Shalom. Shalom.